Hey, this is John Young. Today we're looking at the Ryobi. This is their new One Plus HP brushless. So this is in the HP series, which will allow this 18 volt unit to talk to the battery and get additional. Uh, it's getting better run time because of the brushless technology, and it's going to get more because of, of the, working with the HP batteries. Now this is going to be a different video. It is 22 below right now, and we had a dusting of snow. And you've, some of you have asked how these blowers do in snow. So you're going to get to see this in this live video. I'm going to do a couple of things. We're going to do some, some blowing over here. I'm going to come over actually on this side of the trailer. And we're going to do a little blowing here to show you how this works. This particular blower, and let me give you the, the model number on it. This is, if I can show it to you there, right there it is. This is the P21012VNM. Whew, that's a mouthful for Ryobi model number. But it is the 18, uh, 18 volt brushless blower right there. Okay, so let's see what it can do here. By the way, the, the, the unit doesn't have... It doesn't have a switch beyond it. Has, it has our little trigger, but there isn't a lock-on switch. So you just have that, and that's pretty much it. It's a two-piece. Assemble it, and off you go. So let's take a look and see how it does. So this little unit has 110, uh, it has 110 mile an hour blower in it, and it'll blow about 350 CFM. And that basically tells you the speed that the air is coming out and the amount of air. And that 350 is kind of a big number. And this will fit into many of the blowers that are kind of more than the desktop blower and getting into that leaf blower category. Now, if we take a look here, this is what we just did with the blower. This is done earlier with the shovel. We came through with the shovel. So let's see if we can do anything with that. Okay, that part on the left hasn't been touched. The part ahead, kind of straight ahead of us, has been done. So let's see what it does there. Very nice. Next, we're going to take it to the truck. So the Dakota's got a nice little dusting on it, and I don't want to have to wipe it off. Let's see what the blower does. As you can see up on the top of the truck, that's about six feet away. That's kind of the limit to what the blower can do. You, see, I'm, you can see I'm really not having much of an effect on that, but I'm able to blow across the truck pretty well. This should show us pretty well. So I can just about get all that snow. There's a little wrinkle in the fabric on the other side. Otherwise, I've got it pretty clean. <laughs> Lastly, I'm going to take one pass. I, sho I shoveled one pass, and I'm going to take one pass with the blower and see how far I can move the snow. So there is my one pass that I took with the shovel, and then I'm able to move the snow with the blower.
So that'll give you an idea of what this little blower can do. Once again, this is the one plus series of, of the 18 volt batteries. It'll use any battery, but it does the best with the HP batteries. Uh, it comes uh, with the link in the description below. It comes with a four amp hour battery and charger, all for under $200. Heck, it's under $150. Uh, nice little unit that's gonna be able to move some leaves. And in this case, handle that dusting of snow and clean things right down to the concrete and make it much nicer. So when the sun comes around later today, everything will dry up and be ready for, ready for cars to come through. This is John Young. Thank you for watching. For more tips and how-to videos, go to weekendhandyman.com.